What is Naruto Storm 4 Evolution? Lately during my videos and live streams, some of you have been asking why Choji is a strike back, why Pain can do a full combo as a support, and why the health bars look weird. Well, all questions you have about this will be answered in this video talking about Naruto Storm 4 Evolution. Naruto Storm 4 Evolution is a modded version of Naruto Storm 4 that allows for more of a fun and competitive way of Storm 4 to be played, exclusive to the PC version only. EVO is a community-based project, so although it's managed and maintained by Exact, Playco, and C-Tech, they encourage community feedback on balance changes, new slash old features, and other additions to make Storm 4 EVO the best it can possibly be, making so many PC Naruto Storm 4 players happy with this experience. If you want to hear more about the developer's perspective about EVO and how they introduce Evolution, be sure to go onto the website, the UNS Evolution website, the link will be in the description, go to the About tab and there it will actually show you uh, their description of how they explain EVO. As mentioned previously, Storm 4 EVO has made many changes to take Storm 4 into something better than its regular base game. They've done minor changes such as health bar dividers, giving you a better view of how much damage something can do. Then they've done bigger changes such as changing all dash cuts in game to other typings, making characters like Choji, Guy, and Han strike backs. Making Yamato a charge guard is actually a very good touch. By them doing this, this allows for other characters and team builds to have higher pick rates. I can confidently say that I play Choji and Yamato way more now with this big change. Other notable changes they have made is that they have reverted counters to the state in which they could do strike back after landing them. So for all you counter heavy players out there, there is a free conversion or a free sub waster there for you. Another amazing feature they've brought back is the ability to ninja move out of combos into grabs, making characters such as Ino, Hanzo and Alive Hashirama have more fun with extended combo opportunities since they can all convert into their grabs. There's a few more changes they've made in this video, but I'm not going to go over them all because otherwise this video is going to be very long. If you guys want to see all the changes that has happened in UNS Evolution, then be sure to go to the website once again, go to the change log tab and there you can literally see all the changes that's happened. Testing. As regular patches of Naruto Storm 4 and EVO got released every couple months or so, Exact, Playco, and C-Tech are also busy testing theories, new ideas, and old ideas from previous Storm games in the test builds of Storm 4 Evolution. During a patch's lifespan, what they would do is that they would release a new test build as well, only certain like, available to certain players, and then us players will actually go ahead and test it, test the new changes that they've added onto the patch, and then we let the developers know if we think it's good or bad, and then overall, combined with their opinions and our opinions, they decide if they'll make it to the next live patch of Storm 4 EVA. So for myself, I can say that I actually love the fact that you can actually jump out of ninja moves uh, in the test build currently. That's actually a piece of defensive movement tech that I used to do a lot in Storm, uh, Storm 3 and Revolution. However, I'm not really a big fan of the two counter clash, like the counter clashing animation that can happen. Um, I'm not really a big fan of that. I feel like if you land a counter, then the person who got countered should be punished. So as an example, that's my opinions on the current test patch from the 27th of July. Uh, if you guys want to see all the things that happened in the test logs and the things that have been tested and theorized and what's been kept in and kept out, be sure to go to the test log section of the website. One thing you have to notice is that all the things I've noticed about balance changes and everything in this video is actually very likely to change at some point. Uh, there has been a lot of things that's been taken away and put back in in Naruto Storm Evolution. So a lot of the things that have been said in this video, if you're watching this like months into the future, it could be that things have been added or taken away since then. A lot of testing gets put into this game. For myself, I actually massively am playing Naruto Storm 4 EVO. I personally feel is actually just overall a much more competitive uh, and more of a fun experience. Uh, with the extra tech mode as well, there's a mode in the game called extra tech where you can actually just do things like ninja moving into tilts and doing lots of other fun stuff that not a lot of uh, you know characters can do well. You can make all that very possible, making players like Minato and Toborama and other characters really fun to play again it sort of gives you like a nice storm 3 or a generations feel so for all of us old players it's actually a very nostalgic experience i actually pl enjoy playing this game more than regular storm 4 and uh on this youtube channel and on twitch you can find a lot of us content creators making content on the game so if you do want to find out more about storm 4 evolution then be sure to check out my videos i actually have a nice series on the channel of me versus other players in storm 4 evo if you haven't seen those videos yet i suggest checking them out so you can actually see those changes in play at like high speed competitive-esque battles, uh, I, can, I can say that you're really going to enjoy these uh, videos.
And if you want to be a part of that series, then be sure to hit me up on Discord. I'm always enjoying having fights uploaded onto the channel. And it's actually part of my mission to upload all of the talent that Naruto Storm 4 Evo has. Naruto Storm 4 Evo is actually gaining more players by the day by people who are gaining PCs or already have PCs and just have Storm 4. They're downloading the mod and they're getting on the game. And it's actually a fantastic experience for everybody to do. Anyways, that is it. That is pretty much the summary video. So those of you, if you, if there's somebody who asks you what is Naruto Storm 4 Evolution or they want to know more about Evolution, then be sure to send them this video and this video will perfectly answer any question and if you have any questions that they can just ask down in the comment section below anyways it's been your boy poison akami matane